All right, now we're on this Thuma.com website. And um, right now I'm gonna be opening the sleeve, thoughtfully designed to holster your latest read laptop or tablet, keeping them conveniently within reach off the floor and out of harm's way. Simple hardware free setup, no tools required, made of 100% sustainable wool felt and a heather gray. It's 95 bucks. Um, I got a little bit of a discount on these, I think. I'm not gonna really check the price. I might get like 10% off. And um, there's what it looks like right there. So seamless fit, specifically designed to pair with the bed, which I got. That's gonna be my bed frame. That's gonna be a pretty big reveal. I'm waiting to move those boxes. I need a truck for those, so they're not here yet. The sleeve slim spacious pocket, 13 and a half inch rests flush against the bed's edge, sitting five inches off the floor. Seamlessly tuck away your bedtime leisure without going far. Material matters. Made of an organically dyed sustainable wool felt that's stain resistant by nature, the sleeve keeps things soft and comfortable and is free of plastics and hardware. The solid upcycled rubber wood rod slides beneath the slats, locking the sleeve in place stay in the know and that's basically the other stuff i also got there's something called the tray i'll be revealing that later and i'll be revealing the bed later so i'm still waiting on shipping for the tray and i believe we got one other thing but maybe not but we're gonna open this up it's real light simple i mean you can say it's pretty expensive, but I made it specifically with this bed. And usually you get what you pay for. It looks like fiberglass almost, which is not really that appealing. Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think it could look a little bit nicer instead of looking like fiberglass. It's kind of scary actually, because fiberglass will fuck you up really bad if you fuck with it. Um, there's your steps for putting it in the bed. And we already read all this. And like I said, I mean, I thought it was really nice. I wanted it. And I have a the iPad right here. I mean, this is, let's see how this works. This is what I'm gonna be putting in it. So let's see if it fits. And that's how it goes. So the iPad's gonna be sitting next to my bed with me. I'm gonna try not to put a TV in this room with me. I could, but um, you're not really supposed to have a TV in your bedroom. I mean, I've been doing a lot of uh, self-improvement and stuff like that over the last year or two, and um, there's just a lot of tips, basically. You should not have, like, your... Your bedroom should just be for sleeping. That's basically it. And all I've done for the past year or two is, I mean, I, I sit in bed, watch TV, do everything. My bed is basically has been like my chair or couch in my room. So that's not really good for you. And I have sleeping problems. I stay up late all night, watching TV, playing games, sitting on the iPad. I'm kind of scared actually to even have this iPad in the room with me because they're recommending like when you go to sleep, you put your phone without, like out of reach in a different room or just far away, stuff like that because it's a really big distraction and can cause you lots of sleeping problems if you have sleeping problems because you sit there and tick tock away. I, I don't have tick tock, but um, I'll sit there and buy shit all night long. So anyways, I thought it was cool. We'll see when the tray gets here and um, when I set up the bed. So tell me if you like it. Like, uh, as I it just looks like fiberglass to me, so it's not very appealing. You know, I love gray, but it's just an off gray. And to you, it might look all right. It kind of looks like a floor mat, but to me, it just reminds me of fiberglass. But I'm gonna use it anyways. So let me know what you think. Thanks.